Hey guys, how are you going? And a welcome to a brand new Cricket 19 career mode. Now this career mode is going to be a bit different. I'm going to put the difficulties all on the hardest possible. So I'm calling it the hardest ever career mode. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of rage worthy moments here, but I mean, it's all going to be a bit of fun. I just thought I should uh, mix it up a little bit before hopefully a new cricket game coming out uh, by the end of the year, fingers crossed. But uh, for now, this will run concurrently with the uh, usual career mode. So those episodes will still be coming out. But uh, let's get stuck straight into the character creation. So we are going a new male career mode here. We've got Tony Simpson back in the mixer. I'm going to leave the selection difficulty and all that uh, set to. I'm just gonna, not going to change that. So I don't even think we'll get close to uh, pl playing in the international format. But uh, anyway, we'll just run anyway. We're going to go New Zealand this time. Heard a few people ask for that and we haven't done it before so I thought I'd give it a nudge. Going to start off as a rookie player of course we're going to go through the club level. We're probably going to be staying in the club level for quite some time since it's going to be on the hardest levels and uh, we're going to be pretty average but uh, I am going to uh, stand by as I just uh, create our player here. And here's the player that we're going to be using in this career mode, Terry Turner. The short leggy from uh, New Zealand, hopefully uh, going to be making the black caps sooner rather than later. Of course, number shirt number 22, of course, to the thanks to the great man Richie. Looking at the appearance, we're going to keep it like that, 155 centimeters. He does have a bit of a gut on him as well. It's as big as I can make him. A short, portly man um, who is going to absolutely spin a few, uh, few past the outside edge of the bat, hopefully. And uh, I think one thing, I wanted to make him look good while he had a bat while he was batting and he's got these nice little specs you know with the with the middle part as well he doesn't look creepy at all i don't know what you're talking about but uh, that is who we're going to be using for this uh, career mode and for the bat he's going to be a lower order bowling all rounder so his bat he doesn't have any sponsorships yet he is not the greatest batsman so he's got this old one that he found in the sheds all the best to him on that uh roll of course bowling all rounder he is going to be a lower order batsman batting style i think i went number two yeah i went the wristies uh, the wristy uh, cover drive there, you love to see it. He is an aggressive batsman. He is a leg spinner. And I think there's only two bowling styles. Now this one's got a lot of limbs flying. And then this one is a bit slower, a bit more rhythmical, I should say. I'm going to go with that one. Um, and the bowling, of course, he's, a, he's, an, he's an aggressive bloke. He wants to fire people with his spin, for sure. We have five available skill points. I think we're going to put them all on the bowling at this stage. So we're going to get the flight, the turn, the bounce, the accuracy, and of course the leggy. Um, that's what it's going to be. Uh, oh, stand by. And now, can we do any perks? Okay, Tony, cheers, mate. So I've done uh, these perks here. Test focused flight sim. Moderate increase the flight. Don't mind it. And moderate increase the bounce. So we're going to get some uh, turn and bounce. It's going to be an absolute forced, uh, force to be reckoned with in the club scene. Now, because we're playing as New Zealand, of course, I'm going for my home state, which is the Central Stags uh, team. I'm from Blenheim, so we're going to be using the, the Blenheim side, which I believe is the Blenheim Bulldogs. So there you go. Um, we're just going to go continue on that one and here we go look at that beautiful man terry turner terence his parents call him but uh for this career mode we call him terry looking fantastic and uh can't wait to uh, get started and here we are welcome to the wanganui cricket ground here for this fixture between wanganui and blenheim blenheim have uh, flown up to the north island here for this fixture and we are batting at number eight, I believe. Uh, one of three all around, four all rounders, I think. So hopefully we get a chance with the ball. It is good to be back playing some club cricket, though. It's been quite some time since uh, I think Muppet Extreme Years was probably last time we played club cricket. But uh, the Blenheim Bulldogs have called. And uh, Blenheim, Blenheim have won the toss. What are we doing? It is a dusty, soft pitch. So a good chance for us to roll the arm over, you'd think. And uh, we can have a bowl. Here we go. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh, oh wow okay hold up i mean i'm gonna have to i'm gonna have to have a look at that a bit later or after this ball because wow look how tiny he is too jeez it does not look like he's gonna hurt anyone at all but uh, anyway this is gonna be the first ball i'm actually gonna change the field up to stand by okay this is the field i've gone for quite aggressive early on wanganui none for 12 of six here and the seam of the new or well, the batsman here we go oh hang on oh no first up hopefully this is nothing Dot ball, good. Okay, I have to uh, make it hard, so stand by. Legend, batting hardest. Oh, it's already on hardest. Okay, everything's on hardest. AI is the hardest it can be. Everything is on the hardest. Stand by as we struggle to do anything of note. Okay, let's study this man. How does he look? Now, we've got a nice little turn on the back. I'm not a fan of the uh, the uniforms, but oh, well, we'll get past that. The shoes look nice, matches the kit. I like it. As we see here, the, I mean, the belly, it's not too bad. I mean, I did try to make it as big as possible, but uh, it's as big as it could be. And this guy right here, look, oh my days. I mean, that is someone you do not want to be taking home. 
to uh, meet the parents for sure. Look at those specs. And the, uh, I mean, he's uh, sun conscious, which is what I love. Nice little beard as well. I mean, the, the middle part, there's a lot going on there. Um, let's see how he goes for his first delivery here. Just a little uh, replay of uh, of history, really, as he comes into bowl. Nice, clean action. Yeah, no, they came out all right. And right behind the uh, no ball line, which we love. So, uh, look, he looks fantastic. Okay, we're going to be starting off with a bit of leggy, a bit of flighted leggy. Now, let's try and get a pole early on here. Yep. And it's a not a bad shot there from the seam. He's going to pick up at least a couple. No one in the crowd yet. We are getting some noise. So it looks like they've got the COVID uh, crowd noise on lock. And it was almost a run out. Okay, here we go. We've got a man in short for those ones that pop up. I don't think we're going to get many wickets, though, on hardest. It's driven straight to the man at short cover. I will be utilizing this field quite a bit. I wonder if I can save it right now because I will be using it a lot. I don't think you can in the game. Oh, well, get past that. Come on, Terry. Oh. How was that? Did he edge that onto himself? I think he may have edged it. Good little start here from Cherry. Come on, mate. Let's turn right past him. Driven well, and that is the end of his first ever over. Now, I have heard for a while that uh, people have been wanting me to do a spin bowling career mode, and uh, after doing a bit of uh, Rakeem Cornwall career mode, I was really uh, enjoying the spin bowling. So normally I'm just always doing a pace bowler because um, that is what I try and do in real life, bowl some medium pace, but uh, mixing up with a bit of spin, it's actually been really fun, so look to see a few more of these in the future, I reckon. As Terry has started off pretty well here, 155 centimeters of pure spin. No run, no run. We do have another spinner as well, so we are bowling in tandem with him. So a bit of competition already, which I'm not a fan of in this Blenheim Bulldog side. But hopefully we can jag a few early to really cement our spot as the top spinner of the side. Come on, Terry. Oh, get a man in there. Oh, okay, don't mind that. Oh, there we go, a little swing and a miss there. Shorter ball, driven to the shot. Yeah, he's enjoying that one, I, as I would, mate, as I would, as would I. Jesus Christ, he's got me speaking uh, absolute gibberish at the moment, but uh, this is the effect that Terry has on everyone. Last ball of the third over from Terry, none for four. It's been fantastic, a great start here. Oh! Oh, he's giving him. Oh, you're taking the piss. At first, I thought it missed everything. But on a closer inspection, it must have just uh, kissed the pad or something as Mahana Morea departs for 7 or 40. That is the effect that Terry has. He creates pressure, he gets wickets, and that's what we love. So, historical first wicket for Terry here in the club level scene. Now, this one seemed to just uh, go straight on. Oh, I tell you what, that is an extremely poor call there. But uh, we're not complaining. That is out. Good start from Tez. One for four. Let's continue. Oh, left that. Look, a lot of respect being shown early on here. Now, does he have the googly in his arsenal? Now, he's been leaving some of them. So can we get one to spin back? Oh, I'll tell you what. They did absolutely nothing. But they seem to be playing for the spin. But because we're so average right now, it's not actually turning at all. There we go. A little glance to the leg side. Can't get through, though. Good field being set. Oh, Nassim goes bang down the ground. Finally a bit of aggression shown from the Wanganui batsman. And he's going to pick up a four. It's not too bad. It has uh, it's took a while for him to uh, try to expand his range, and he's done so nicely. Okay, here we go. Walking out to bat, we did not get another chance with the ball, surprisingly, after a good start. But uh, let's unpack this a bit. Now, what did Wanganui end up with? 175 all out. We bowled five overs, one for eight of two. Uh, one for eight of five overs with two maidens. Jeez, we bowled well. I don't understand why we didn't get another trundle, but there you go. It is club cricket. Everyone gets a go. And uh, Blenheim in reply. 6 for 160. Bit of a low score at the moment. We only trail by 15. And here we go. Playing on the hardest level with the batting, remember. This can only end poorly. No run, no run. Good block shot there from uh, Terry. I really don't know what to expect with the batting here. Usually, I mean, batting is a lot harder on hardest than what bowling is. And there we go, straight away. I should have known, I should have known not to flail at one early on because you're going to get out, you're absolute muppet. Come on, Terry, you're better than that. That's why you're down number eight, mate, because you are struggling at everything. There we go, three ball duck in the debut. Not great, mate, not great, Terry. And here we go, back to another trundle. Wanganui in trouble, eight now, three for 81. We're going to keep this field because it worked well last time. And we should have bowled more. I don't know what the captain was up to. 
Swept straight away. Oh, a little edge. Almost carried to short leg. I mean, we're not getting any turn at the moment, and it is a turning pitch, so it just goes to show. Uh, we definitely need to work on the skill, as that one has been glanced away for a single. Can't tears. None for five or three. Another solid start. Ooh, he's gone for the sweep again. Misses out. Old uh, Vahari, 33 of 61. They've just got a lead here. And they're three down, so they'll be looking to get a nice little total for us to chase. Do we need to bring someone in short on the offside as well? I'm thinking that, but who would I take out? Maybe like mid on? I reckon maybe mid on actually. Let's give it a go. Well left. Okay, here we go. Claustrophobic fielding for the batsman. Oh, mate, don't miss those ones. That is tracking to be plum because it's not turning. On is a turning pitch. We're in some real strife here if we can't get it to turn. Yep, straight on. Almost a uh, almost a googly, even though it's supposed to be a leggy. Oh, well. Last ball of the over. Oh, I'll tell you what. We'll go up just to put a bit of pressure on the umpire, but it won't be out. A full toppy. Surely the hurry goes bang. It's almost a Yorker, I'd say. Uh, he's going to get just the one out of it as well. Yes, he is. Not bad for Maria. It was a... Uh, it was pretty yuck, uh, yuck ball to be fair. Wide outside off. He could hit it anywhere he wanted to, and he chose a boundary, which is not a bad call. Rune brought back on here, Terry. Six overs, two maidens, none for 12. Now, let's see what he uh, can extract out of this pitch here. Not a whole lot, no. These sweeps that he's doing, they're quite upper, so I'm thinking just to put a bit of pressure back on the batsman, I'm going to put him into a little leg slip. Now, if he does go for that, there could be some bullshit. Uh, uh, reactions that we could see get us a wicket here yeah, yeah. oh okay I mean sure we'll get a lefty on strike here we go first time bowling to a lefty cooler 12 of 28 or oh, well left not a lot of bounce yep. oh oh no it's worked but it hasn't worked what are you doing I mean he should have never got into a position to be able to catch that uh, let's take a look at this a bit closer though because he did leap he, that was exactly what I wanted him to do with the sweep shot. It was uppish. Look at that. There's no rotations on the ball whatsoever. Oh, he's almost double hit it here. And then leg slip. He's gone for the dive. Imagine if he caught it. Who was it? We're just getting to know our team members here. Morris. Good on you, Morris. What a moz. Oh, well. Could have had a wicket. Could have had cool up. It doesn't matter, though. We're bowling nice. Eventually, this pressure is going to culminate in some sort of yuck shot. And we'll get our wicket that way. Oh, how was that? Odd mate has put up his half century of 127. It's been a great knock considering the uh, how the game's been going. I just need to stay out there. Now, I'm pretty sure this is day two. Let's take a look. No, it's day three. Ten, oh, it's just the start of day three. So we've got to try and get these wickets quickly. And then try and smash it for the win. Oh, another swing and a miss. He's got his 50. Now he wants to launch. Oh, okay. Oh, my eyes lit up then. I thought we were a huge chance, but Morea absolutely launches it down the ground for four. Another wicket is falling huge here for the Bulldogs. Six for one, six three, char uh, lead of 74. Here we go. Keep using the fielders. Keep building the pressure. Morea, once again, will be looking to launch down the ground, and that is when we'll pick up a little edge. No, yep, nice. Okay, walking out to bat here. Come on, Terry. Let's try and get your first club run, but I think we're in a bit of strife. We are. Oh, wow. So, oh, wow. Okay. 12.30. It is so much time to play. So they've got all that for 184. We went wicketless, which wasn't great, but now we only need 44 more runs. We've got four wickets left. Samuel, seven. Got a bit of pace in Matthew now. We do have a lot of time, so I'm going to be taking it very slow. That is a great shot to start off. But if we can get a cheeky 20 not out to guide the Bulldogs home here, this will be a cracking start to the club cricket scene. And hopefully no schnicking off. Solid no run once again. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, there we go. A first club run. Via an overthrow, wouldn't have it any other way. Congratulations, Terry. Okay, this is when we get in some strife here. Old Michael. Now, I'm not a fan because I think we're going to pop it up. Oh, that is very, very solid. And now they brought two men in now. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh, we'll leave it. Yeah. Oh, he's getting a bit of turn. Got more turn than us. One for four, old Michael. He's done well to start off. Now, at least they put the man back from the short cover. Solid. Yes. 
Let's set us outside the line. Thank goodness for that, because if you gave us out, I would have been absolutely irreparable. But uh, we look to find another day. Of course, no Darius in club cricket, as uh, as much as I'd like it to be. It's just not possible. Solid. Great over. Great spell of batting. We have just walked off for lunch as well. So 6 for 52, bit of strife. A lot of work needed to be done. We do have uh, still only 6 down, but this spin is, I'm not a fan of it at all. Samuel doing the scoring here, 13 off 18. If we can just stay out with him, then I'll be fine. Leave it. Yes, well left. I kind of want to try. Oh no, they've got a leg slip and I was thinking a sweep, but it's probably a bit of a poor option at this stage. Solid. Extremely solid there, boy. I just don't see where we're going to get these runs. I mean, we've got full confidence. Although, I don't have any confidence in him whatsoever. Last ball of the over. We have been trying to sweep it this uh, over, not to any luck. Oh, oh, no, no, no. I've absolutely sold him down the river there. I have. I don't know why I've done this. I don't. I genuinely do not know. I thought we were. I didn't realize he was going to be that quick. I was expecting the game to be a bit laggy, a bit shit. But he's absolutely taught me a new one there. And I'm very, very sorry there, Honey Samuel. I've cost us any chance. It's not a great start to the uh, career or the debut when you burn a, another batsman who's probably going to win the game for you. And just your first game as well. You're probably going to need a few dirty looks as you walk off the field. But now it comes up to us. Honey Parler, the new batsman. Can we get the side can we get the side over the line here? We need another thirty-four more runs. Oh, it's a gorgeous shot. Gore, first real sign of a aggression here. First attacking shot. And he will get two for his troubles. That is a fantastic shot. Come down to an absolute thriller here. Seven for sixty-four. This is club cricket and its finest. Come on, Turner. Yep. Oh, it's a too early there, 128k has absolutely done me. Question I have to ask myself, how confident am I of the other batsman? Uh, do I go for a single? Oh my lord. Or we can just play an exquisite cut shot. Oh boy, we can get three out of here. This could be the best of both worlds. Oh yes, we've got it easily. We can always run on a club cricketer's arm for sure. Another spinner, Joe, two for 17. Where are, where are these spinners coming from? Oh, it's an offie. Okay, offies are probably a bit easier to deal with than the leggies. They do. It's, a, once again, a very aggressive field, as it should be. Really putting the pressure on us. We need another 26 runs, but three wickets to go for Wong and Nui. And that's no run. Turning into a real thriller here. As you can see, the people on the, at the pavilion there getting some sun, getting some shade from the sun. And rightly so. Oh, we missed out on a blue ball there. I don't think we could hit it anywhere, though, because we seem to be quite weak. Oh, you fuck. It's a really fucking fine line here between it was okay forward, good shot, and great and like really good shot selection. Yet we still edge it. It's like I mean I know hardest is supposed to be the hardest as it can be, but it just feels so broken. Where that sort of shot probably shouldn't be edged like that. You've got to be perfect. You've got to be right on for it not to fuck up. And unfortunately, there we depart for what seven. Now I don't think they're going to chase it down. Oh, they've done it. They've done it by one wicket. Get up, Blenheim. Get up, the Bulldogs. Huge. What a match. What a match for our debut. So let's unpack this. We uh, we bowled first. It is a, It was a turning pitch, although we couldn't get any turn off it. We did pick up a wicket, though. One for eight of five with two maidens. A great start to the career. We did then make a three-ball duck, um, which brought us back down to reality a bit. And then we had another bowl. We went wicketless, but we bowled all right, I thought. Down for 26 off 11. Most economical there. No wickets, though. And then with the bat, we went all right. We went better than I thought we would. 7 off 34. We did burn a, um, we did burn our, uh, another batsman, but that's pretty standard for us. Um, luckily, the 9 wicket, uh, or the 10th wicket partnership, what was it? They needed 8 runs to win, and they did it off the last part, off the last wicket. It's great to see, and it's a great start to the career. So that is going to be it for the first episode of this hardest ever career mode in Jesus. It was it was definitely hard. The batting I find is going to be extremely difficult for us. We're going to be, I'll be we'll be lucky to average ten. If we can average ten, I think that's a win for us. Uh, the bowling is going to be a bit easier, but we still struggle to pick up wickets in the second dig. Uh, next up, we are playing a 50 over in a 2020 match against uh, Wanganui. First up, 
Uh, but uh, yeah, it's going to be an exciting time. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below if this is a career mode that uh, you'll be keen for. I had a lot of fun, to be fair, um, playing that, playing as a spinner, a career mode, is definitely a, a lot, f uh, a bit of fun. Don't mind it at all. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like and subscribe. Feeling up to it, leave a comment down below. Love to see them, love to read them. But uh, yeah, until then, take it easy.